Welcome back to another episode of Chainsaw Man. Last episode, what happened? We had a little bit of a party and Denji's first kiss was puke from Himeno. First of all, his first tick grab was also fraudulent. Power had the padding in. Now his first kiss was just all puke. And now our boy might lose his virginity. Himeno's making a move, but... Probably nothing is gonna happen. I like I, I have pretty much any sexual advance that made, that's made on Denji. I just expect all it's just to flop. Plus, we had that talk of if we don't establish some level of intimacy, if the person that you're trying to do etchy things with, with remember what Bakima said, if you're not intimate with that person, then it's just gonna feel empty. And the chase after the booba was better than the booba itself, which is quite philosophical, even though I just said booba over and over again, so it doesn't really make it sound that deep, but you know what I'm trying to say. A lot of people might think that right now, the episodes like, especially the previous episode, even though we did fight the infinite devil and kind of beat him, that uh, like this party scenes, more slice of life moments, the character interactions. I th I don't think a lot of people might appreciate this as much as they should be because the manga readers know we should enjoy the peaceful, you know, the fun times that we're having right now. Because let me tell you something, this anime, this series, it's not as happy go lucky as you might think. Let's watch today's episode. Oh, this is Himeno walking, uh, <laughs> carrying this kidnapping Denji. <laughs> uh, nice. I like the little touch of the second chair falling, but. Nice land. Water? Here, have some beer instead. <laughs> oh. This first person POV is kind of interesting. Hello. And then this was the like the ending scene. <laughs> up we go. Alright, drink up, Denji. Oh, goddamn. Before, it, this is like a repeat scene, but... Before, we were seeing it from Denji's perspective, and now we kind of saw it from Himeno's perspective. I like that they're, like, going out of their way to just make it all so scenic. What are you doing here? It's not like I fucking kidnapped you and dragged you home. And then we were left on a cliff from Ice Forty God. If they do this, and then we have the opening play as soon as she asks, as, like, a double cliffhanger. Bruh, don't bait me again. Here we go. Here we go. And then the opening play. No, not yet. Never mind. Oh no! Oh, we're getting it. Yeah. Spell it out. Holy shit! She actually did. But. Pick him up. Ah. <laughs> Just yes, ma'am. Yeah, she did. She puked all over your dreams, dude. Denji, value yourself. Don't be so down yes. bad. Yeah, yes. <laughs> yeah, I'm down. Huh? Oh, oh shit. This angle. Hey, hey, yo, this angle, though. Holy shit. They're going hard with the. Like, there's no need to go in this much detail over the scene from the manga, I think. But they're really just doing it. Sex sells, obviously. Huh? You're not hard. What's up? Oh. Hmm? The fuck? Candy? Yeah, it did. She saw all of it. <laughs> it's gonna be ruined. You're gonna remember the puke every time. Maybe. <laughs> this is a curse. Oh. Oh. Taste this instead of the puke. Oh! Oh! Yo, when Makima does stuff like this, it really does feel like she cares about us, you know? But like, sometimes she's so sus and just feels like she's using us. But then there's times like this where she's just like professionally grooming Denji and I'm just falling for it. Wait, Himen was passed out. Denji's sleeping on the floor, meaning he denied her. I don't think Pochita really cares. I think Pochita just wants to see your dreams. Did I do something I wasn't supposed to? She capped and she lying! Take responsibility! Or maybe she's true. Does it make it any better? Who cares? Why am I talking about this anime? Look how nicely the sandwich is cut though. Exactly! That's what I'm saying! He's 16! Isn't he a minor? But in Japan, apparently... When are you not a minor in Japan? Is it 18 or is it... 
Like, age of consent apparently is 16, but you're still illegal until you're 18 or something. I don't know. Everybody. Super life here. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I guess we're not really after her Makima's personality. Yeah? Really? Ultimate wing girl? Really? Secret alliance to get Denji laid? Oh. It's a deal. <laughs> That's it? Okay, sure, I'm in. <laughs> Alright, super secret alliance. I think we're a little bit beyond friends at this point, but sure. <laughs> Even power? <laughs> Himena is so down that she's willing to risk her nice apartment by bringing power also? That's right, Makima was going on a business trip to Kyoto, right? Yeah. This is a uh, very scenic train scene. Hey, you saw those heads. Hey, we hear zipping. What are you doing? That's a gun. That's a fucking gun. She's not dead. Come on. You really think Ibakima? She looks pretty done here, doesn't she? Come on, it's no eat. Relax. No, we're getting baited. Don't get baited. Kuveni. Everything is so scenic right now. Just no dialogue. Just hey yo! Wait 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 wait! Everybody's got a gun. Holy sh! Wait, come on, you get down. Come on, you get down. Who organized all this? Grandma, how could you? Oh, it's a grandpa. Grams, how could you? Come on, you get the <laughs> Your shit's going down right now. There's a bit of like a Makima assassination plot. Everyone else seems to be getting hit too. Would people from this restaurant also shoot us? Also, Denji is kind of a gentleman. Hmm? Is this gonna? Is he gonna shoot us? Why are you starting cat conversation like that? Who are you? I feel like he's gonna pull out a gun and shoot us. Here comes the gun! Here comes the gun! Hey, 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 hey! Jesus Christ. Denji? Oh, wait! That's the guy that, like, um... Yeah, in, like, the first episode, right? He's the one that turned into the, the zombie devil. There's the gun. It's okay, Denji is fine. He can just rip the cord, but everyone else is a bit dangerous. Oh, power with the uppercut. Wait, is it? It's a little much, but... <laughs> okay, sure. <laughs> a little bit of an overkill for one person, but okay. You have to get it done. That guy had a gun, though. Denji will be fine. Rip his cord. Yank the cord. Himeno might not be fine. Bro. This is the fox devil talking. Neither human nor devil. Wait, the fox is... Who is this dude? Oh, I'm starting to remember from the manga. This guy's sick. Now, remember, guess what kind of devil he is, right? It's whoever's, you know, Denji has a chainsaw sticking out of his head, so he's a chainsaw devil. Therefore, he is probably like a sword devil, katana devil. But Himeno doesn't look too good right now. I think Himeno's about to die. Oh! So... Three. That's the fox devil still talking, right? Where was that three as in he three like three sword style? No, this is the fox devil talking, I think. What happens if it reaches one and then zero? One more. One more. Curse. Is this a different devil than I thought? Because I thought... This looks a bit different from the fox for sure, right? Oh. Oh, dude. It's getting serious. 
This reminds me of like uh, Sarutobi versus Orochimaru, how he cursed Orochimaru at the end and just took his soul, but... Okay. Aki has that kind of power too? Okay, what about Himeno though? That's left side of the chest. That's that's the heart. The curse devil. Was this? Yeah, you learned the mechanics. So he has the fox devil and the curse devil. How many other contracts do you have? You're gonna heal him up? Why is he up? How is he up? What did you do to him? What about our curse? The f Uh, uh no okay he's talking to him what is she okay we're fighting again yaki yeah, might need some backup nothing personal kid that was super fast please don't let there be like cuts and blood just squirting all out of denji because he moves so fast please please no that's like the most cliche anime swordsman thing okay then she shot in the head. Aki you know, slashed across the chest. He made a gun through the heart. There's only power left. I want to go back to our slice of life vibes. Back at the party, man. What the fuck? Okay, he was still talking. Looking so bad. Dreadful. That's kind of crazy, huh? If a devil is calling another person dread. That's too much blood. Himeno, we just got to know you. Don't pull this shit on us. Because she loves Aki so much. She's like making her final deal, I think. I think Himen is about to like, make the ultimate sacrifice for Aki. Oh Jesus, how many hands do you have? Oh. The artistic design of Chainsaw Man is so it's just like It's crazy. What is this thing? This is the ghost. Yeah, I'd be wordless too. I mean, we knew the nature of this job. We knew that average tenure is like less than a month. It's a young man's job, as said by Kishibe, right? So you shouldn't get attached to anybody. But, bro, I should have been. Because we have so many arms gone, that's a sacrifice. I should have known something. As soon as they give us so much Himeno scenes in the past, like a couple episodes. Her arm's gonna disappear too now. What is this girl though? What is she doing? Oh my god. Two arms gone. How much of her is she sacrificing though at this rate? Her entire being, I guess. This is a preemptive salute. Why did I get attached? I knew this was coming too. It's like, I don't want to cry. Don't. Snake. The snake devil. So even after Himeno sacrificed everything, it gets. Countered by the snake? Holy shit, so fast. There's probably nothing there. It's probably an empty suit. I shouldn't make a joke. That's not her thong, it's an eye patch. But salute. Salute. I told you, don't get attached to characters in this show. I wanna go back to Slice of Life. Man, we only knew Himeno for like what three to four episodes. Not maybe just three episodes. Like we just met her and then we had a little party and I was kind of shitting on her for puking in Denji's mouth and you know, not kidnapped. I'm just trying to make a joke and make it funnier, but then brought her out. And we had a nice friend! We just became friends! Secret alliance for the sake of Aki, but for the sake of Aki. She sacrifices everything at the end. Gives everything to the ghost devil. But even then that's not enough. The snake devil basically just destroyed it, I guess? It's kind of ridiculous, but Ghost Devil did say that girl was dreadful. There's something up with her. Another thing that happened was Makima and her crew got shot in the train. She's too important of a figure to die this early. It doesn't make sense. But seeing as Chainsaw Man it seems to not really give a fuck and just does whatever he wants to do, could Makima be dead? I could believe it. I could believe it with the way the show was going. 
we're at the last, I think, um, bit of Chain Summon as I think this is like episode eight. So I'm guessing we're going into the last arc. Shit's starting off pretty strong. And what did I say? If you were bored of the previous episodes, you're gonna miss it because Slice of Life moments, they're very few, but they're so precious because it's just despair all the time in this series, which is pretty much why this shit was good, but still, rest in peace, Himeno. <laughs> I already knew it was going to come, but God damn it. Anyways, if you stick around this song, if you enjoy my reaction, you already know what I'm going to say. Check out the other videos and playlists to my channel. If you watch another video immediately after this one, it helps the YouTube algorithm push out my small channel to recommend so that I have a chance to compete with some of our favorite reactors. Until next time, guys, take care.